The CIWS was historically designed to be the last line of defense for automated weapons, also known as terminal defense or point defense, against any and all incoming threats, including sea skimmers with high G and maneuverability. The first prototype system was given to the U.S. Navy in 1973 for testing on the destroyer USS King, and it was determined that additional work was required to improve performance and dependability. Following that, the Phalanx Operational Suitability Model passed its operational test and evaluation in 1977 while aboard the destroyer USS Bigelow. Reliability, availability, and operational maintenance criteria were all exceeded by the model. In 1978, the weapon system received a license for manufacture after a successful second review. The first ship to be fully outfitted was the aircraft carrier USS Coral Sea in 1980.